Hello everybody, my name is GatorKG122 and welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. Last time, we finally got into contact with Oya and she was able to reveal the name of the Mafia boss who is running things amok in Shibuya, Junior Kanashiro. So this time on Persona 5 Royal, we're going to at least make an attempt to enter Kanashiro's palace with our friends tomorrow. Am I allowed to leave? Like, in its entirety, can I leave? Okay. No. I cannot leave. But the fact that I can leave my room means I can do activities. How about, how's the plant? Ooh, we need to give it some nutrients. We need to give this plant good care. We must take care of the plant. All right, and with that, we got a little more kindness. We are slightly more considerate than before. That should do it for a while. Okay, well, if I can't leave, do I have any, let me think. I'm gonna, first of all, get Kawakami to brew some Le blonde coffee. Kawakami can only be called a blonde for housekeeping after it is closed. Customers and Sojo will leave the cafe at that time, so be aware of this if you have any business with them. Hey. You gonna try to make some coffee? Well, we're gonna call Kawakami. Cost 5,000 yen to call Kawakami over. Still want to do it? Yeah, I still want to do it. Yep. Make sure you're Don't waste up. the beans, got it? I'm gonna head home. Hi. Hello, Master. Thanks for calling. This is Becky. Oh, wait, you. Did you want to use the delivery service? Okay, I'll be there soon. Thank you for your continued patronage. That will be 5,000 yen. It's worth it, guys, I swear. Hmm, so you just want me to make some coffee, right? So, she's gonna do that. And while she's doing that, I am gonna work on making some infiltration tools. Okay. You'll probably make four. Good luck. So, let's see. What will we make each of the battle items? We haven't really gotten a chance to make one of these, so... Molotov cocktail. Yeah. <laughs> wow, an efficient use of materials, you end up with even more than I expected. Now we got a Molotov cocktail. Then we'll go ahead and make... What's a spotlight? Raise the chance of being targeted by foes for one ally. Vanish ball. Guarantee to escape a battle, not all battles apply. Okay, I'll make a couple of these because these could be pretty useful in a tight spot. Yeah. Let's make three vanish balls. Three vanish balls. Yes. You're definitely getting better. I can tell just by watching you. Yeah. All right, we are slightly more skilled. I saw that, the way you used your hands. You did great. Extra proficiency. Well, then. Okay, let's go to bed. Hi. Thank you for waiting. Here you go. And we got some LeBlanc coffee. Thanks to Kawakami. All right, I'll see you later. me yesterday. I almost entered a world I want nothing to do with. What are you talking about? Nothing. Just start it up, Yusuke. Okay, I entered Kaneshiro's name into the nav. And just as expected, it's a hit. All we need now are the two other key words. What he thinks of as his palace, and where it is. But we don't have any clues other than people falling victim around here. Eh, we'll just have to try whatever keywords we can come up with. Oh, that's gonna be impossible. How many buildings do you think there are in Shibuya? No complaining. If we can figure out what the palace is, we may be able to guess where it is by association. Hmm, it's probably somewhere he's got complete control over. 
maybe a garden? No candidates found. He likes money, so what about a money bath? I've seen people online with things like that. No candidates found. No, not even close. How could you tell? How about it? Can you think of anything? Um. Uh, what about a bank? I see. Candidate found. Okay, that's a hit. So, he thinks of somewhere in this city as his own bank. I thought it'd be something less realistic. That's all it is, huh? Now then, what location would Kaneshiro think of as his bank? If we're talking about a place where he keeps his cash, maybe his own hideout? How about a real bank? His cognition wouldn't be distorted in that case. Damn it, we ain't getting anywhere. This may be difficult to explain, but doesn't it seem we're thinking a little too inside the box? Palaces emanate a passionate madness. It feels as though we're missing that aspect. The hell are you talking about? This palace is a bank for someone who extorts money with criminal acts. It's something more... But what other ways can we think about it? Oh, could it mean a place you withdraw money? That would be a bank, sweetheart. Hold on. Do you think it might have something to do with the victims? He's taking money from his victims' wallets, right? That means his bank is wherever they are. That's terrible. But you may just be right. Oh, come on! How many people do you think Kaneshiro's taken advantage of in all of Shibuya? Results found. Wait a second. I have a hit. Huh? Oh, wait, what? D did I say something right? That's a first. The place that Kaneshiro thinks of as a bank is all of Shibuya. What? Like... The entire city? I see. That's certainly where his victims are. It turns out he really is a terrible criminal. But wait, is it okay for us to go into the palace right out of a crowd like this? Eh, nobody notices if a piece of trash disappears from a trash can. This ain't any different. You literally just called yourself trash. So fine. In that case, let's go. What are those? Walking ATMs. That must be his cognition of people. So this is what Kaneshiro considers a bank. I never thought it would be the entire district. Look around us. The distortion is affecting the whole of Shibuya. Huh? What do you mean? Oh, that's right. Even when we were in the castle and the museum, the city outside looked normal. He sees everyone in Shibuya as his patron. No surprise for a mafia boss. It's best we focus on finding Kaneshiro's location and stealing his treasure as soon as possible. Yeah, his hideout's gotta be somewhere around here. Let's go look for it. Let's go. In any case, let's look for a bank. There should be a huge one around here somewhere. Okay. Let's go. Oh, look at that person trembling over there. Do you think he's a victim? You should talk to him. Uh, do these guys even have mouths? Excuse me, can we... Ah, uh, please forgive me. What happened? I, I don't have any more, please! I'm telling you, not even one yen! Come on, man. Whoa, cool it. We're not trying to mug you or anything. Please, I don't want to end up like the others. Were you assaulted? Yeek! <sighs> There's no doubt he's a victim, but he can't even hold a 
conversation. Let's try somewhere else. This is weird walking around Shibuya in the metaverse. Because, like, yeah, again, it's all of Shibuya. It's the whole of Shibuya. How do we not realize this when we enter mementos from Shibuya? Perhaps. Are those... No. This is terrible. All of these are real people, right? This is effed up. I don't think we can talk to any of the ones here. Okay. Damn it. Are all these guys Kanashiro's victims? That would appear to be the case, but there is nobody we can speak to, let alone a bank anywhere. Joker. Let us try checking around the station once more. We may have overlooked something important. Oh, we've definitely overlooked a little something. Is there money blowing around? Oh, look! Do you think that person's a victim too? Hey. Excuse me, can we have a word? We are... It's no use. All over. I'll end up just like them. What happened? Can't you tell? I've fallen. Fallen so far. From a place where Kanashiro leaves no track. What do you mean? What could that mean? Hey, you gotta tell us a little more than- I'm too tired. Please, let me rest. Doesn't look like this one's going to say anything. Great observation, Morgana! Kinda sure leaves no tracks. Does he mean that literally, or could it be figurative? Hey. Why don't we go over all the intel we have now? They have apparently fallen quite far. Wait a second. They've fallen from a place where Kanashiro doesn't leave any tracks. Could that mean they were actually thrown down from somewhere high up? Uh... What? You mean like a skyscraper? Uh, there ain't any of those around here, I don't think. No. Wait, what's that? Okay. Is that it? Is that it? Do you think? Up in the air. No wonder we couldn't find it. Kanashiro doesn't leave any tracks, huh? Figures it'd be floating. So, uh, how do we get up there? Can you turn into a helicopter, Morgana? No, just a car. You're useless! Come on! Don't you have some kind of secret gadget or something? He did give me a grappling hook, but... I think I'm gonna need a longer grapple. Shut it! I'm not some robot cat! I mean, I'm not a cat at all! This may be the limit of what we can do today. <sighs> we gotta find a way to get up there. Let's think about it some more tomorrow, okay? Alright, we should get out of here for now. Run for it! Okay. Well, that was disappointing. I have a new message from Oya. Evening. It's that woman who reeks of alcohol. You free? Uh, slow day, eh? I'm texting you amid my busy work schedule. It's about the kind of sheer guy. He's more dangerous than I thought. The police haven't tracked him down, so I dug a little deeper. Turns out he has some real shady connections. I won't say any more than that. Shady connections. He's not someone a teenager that you should mess with. You should really back off, okay? Well, that's all I wanted to say. See ya. Proving our justice isn't going to be easy. We'd better discuss this with everyone tomorrow. <sighs> and just when we find the palace, it's all the way up in the sky. What a pain. I'm sure the police are tired of this guy, too. Well, then. That reminds me, the home shopping program is airing today. You want to check out the TV? Might as well. Hi everyone, it's time to do some shopping. Here's what we've got for you today. 
Here's the first one, the supportive gift set. Give this to the busy bee in your life and you'll be sure to get along. One blurry alarm clock and one face beautifier. Both items in one set, what a steal. But that's not all, there's more. Next up, the busy revival set. With this, nothing will be able to keep you down. Three revivadrin and 10 recover our 100 MG. These will both be in one set, what a steal. Wow, they're both such great items, I can't decide which one to get. All right, this is a limited item. Today's the one and only day it'll be available. And of course, the price is just right. You won't see this kind of deal ever again. Oh, the phones are already ringing off the hook. Only a few remaining. Now's your final chance to buy, buy, buy. Hey, Apparently, hey. the phones are ringing on stop. If we buy one, then the other will probably be sold before we can get it. Oh, wow, they're both the exact same price. Of over 9,000 yen. As... Helpful as the Busy Revival Pack would be, I'm gonna get the supportive gift set because those are more unique items. We'll have plenty of opportunities to buy items that will help us recover HP and revive later. Plus, we already have some good stuff right now. So, I'm gonna get the supportive gift set. Oh, another buyer's just called in. Thank you so much. Oh, they're both sold out? That last customer was extremely lucky. We'll try to get your order to you as quickly as possible. Goodbye for now. We'll see you again next time with another fabulous product. Goodbye for now. Well then. Now all we have to do is wait for it to arrive. I'm guessing I still can't leave. Hey. Nope. We literally did nothing in the metaverse, but whatever. Well, considering that we can't leave, I'm gonna study. It's better for me to study than for me to worry about my HP. Now listen up. What do you want Might as well go ahead and study since we don't have much else to do. Wow. Whoa, you can answer these difficult problems? You're amazing. You're making some good progress. I can see the wisdom in your eyes behind those glasses. <laughs> You'll tire yourself out if you keep at it for too long. You should stop for today and get some sleep. I've been thinking lately. About those phantom thieves, I mean. If Dad were still alive... Sorry, I... I shouldn't bring this up while we're eating. It's okay. Keep going. I just wonder if... He would have been on their side. That's all. The only reason you have time to think about that is because you depend on someone else. That's not... You don't have to do a single thing, and you're provided with food, clothes, a home. I've had no time to think on such ridiculous thoughts. Would Dad have been happy with them? I don't care! He died upholding some lofty sense of righteousness, leaving all his responsibilities on us. Uh, all I was trying to say was... Isn't it about time you grew up and acknowledged our situation? Right now, you're useless to me. All you do is eat away at my life. <sighs> Sorry, that was uncalled for. I'm just... Really tired. I'll be eating dinner out from tomorrow on. Uh. I just remembered. I've been seeing a lot of shows on TV lately about the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. I just wonder why bother stealing hearts? If I were them, I would go for something with concrete, clear value, like gold. Speaking of, there's another kid kind of metal that's very valuable in its own way. They're called minor metals, and they're used in many electronics. In fact, most of you probably have some on your purse right now. In your pockets, in your purses. Give me an answer. Were you listening, Takamaki-san? Give me one example of something most of you have that contains minor metals. Huh? Oh, uh, yeah, I mean... Hey, wait! 
Hey, Lady On is obviously panicking. Be a good guy and help her out. Hey, this wow, I don't know at all. Sorry, Ren, can you help me out? Something that uses minor metals. And all of us have something like that on us? Uh, right now, I've got lipstick, my smartphone, and mascara. What do you think, Ren? One of these has minor metals in it, right? It's your smartphone. My smartphone? Oh yeah, she said something about electronics, right? Okay. I'm so the answer must be my smartphone. This is it. Correct. Precisely. No way. A lot of minor metals are excavated in China. Some countries simply produce more than others. Ninety percent of the minor metals used in Japan are imported. But a lot of the recyclable trash we throw away contains minor metals too. In other words, a junkyard is much more valuable than someone else's heart. Phew, thanks for the help! Nice, going. nice. Lady Aunt seems really relieved. We're closer, I'm smarter, and more charmful. Everyone wins. You're pretty good studying, I'm impressed. Got nothing. Are we out of luck? It's no fair his palace is up in the sky. If only we could contact the real Kanashiro. Hmm? What do you want? Nothing in particular. I just saw you all together here. Huh, that's so. You seem to be having quite a bit of trouble. So you're here to check up on us? You may be the student council president, but when it comes to what we do, you're useless. Oh, they both said useless. Useless? Right now, you're useless to me. All you do is eat away at my life. To be frank, yes. Just stay on your high horse and watch. Or do you want to eavesdrop, since you're so good at it? She's really, really not. <sighs> so you wish to get in contact with Kanashiro? How did you get his name? We didn't tell you. That is what you were just discussing, weren't you? Okay, maybe she's better at eavesdropping than I thought. It seemed you just needed to find out where he is. Uh, something like that. Answer her honestly. So you're just the good girl type to push over. Right now, you're useless to me. I'm not. What was that? Fine. I'll help you meet Kanashiro. What exactly is she planning on doing? She had a dead serious look in her eyes. Does this mean she has an idea as to where Kanashiro may be? I highly doubt that. I didn't like her stern face. Uh, what is up with her? We should probably go save her. Before she does something stupid. There are way too many people here. <sighs> We're never gonna find her. Makoto Nijima. Just stay on the phone and listen. Make sure you record the call as well. Huh? Who is it? Do you guys know Kanashiro? What? That idiot! What's she doing? I heard I could find someone named Kanashiro if I came to Central Street. Central Street? She's being too rash. What are you getting at? He's blackmailing the students at Shujin Academy, is he not? Tell him if he doesn't want me talking to the police about it, he better agree to meet with me. You got a death wish or something? He says he'll meet you. Get in. You better be taking me to Kanashiro. He said get the fuck in! Whoa, hey, language. Hey, 
Hey, wasn't that... It's the guys that messed with us the other day. So they were connected to Kaneshiro. Is she still on? Contact Kaneshiro-san. Tell him we got a good one. Where are we going? Yeah, I guess we can't do anything to her if she's Kaneshiro-san's customer. Hey, I asked a question here. Where are we going? We gotta go after them! That's why she's asking where they're going! Ryuji, get a taxi. I'll... Okay, I've got their license plate. My sketching skills have come in handy. Thank God for you, Yusuke! Whoa, hey man. Ryuji! Hurry up and get in. So, you're seriously the student council president of Shujin. You know what happens to anyone who snaps at me, don't you? So, whose number is this? Your boyfriend? What in the world? Who the fuck are you? Wow, two in one episode. We're really laying the groundwork for some new content. Nijima-san! What the hell did you do to her? Oh, I get it. You got followed, you dumb shits! Holy moly! That bag you saw the other day, the crocodile one? How much was it? Mm, about three million. Ah! <gasps> For real? Better thank those guys. What? I'm royally pissed right now. Can you tell? You know how spending money relieves stress? It's you goddamn brats sniffing around like dogs and barging in here like you own the joint. See this empty space? I'm so pissed that now there's a three million yen gap here. It pisses me off even more if I don't fill it up. I'm a perfectionist. So, good luck. What is that supposed to mean? Come on, you all look so tense. I think I'll call it debauchery of minors at a club. So, can I send this to your school? Uh, that's... Oh, damn, I got booze and six in the shot. Maybe some drugs, too. Ah, this is so hilarious. I feed on dumb shits like you. Understand, pretty little student council president. Now listen up. Run your mouth to the police, and I'll break all of you, starting with your families. I want to give you the usual month, but well, you have such a large group here. Three weeks. Bring three million yen by then, no less. Summer bonuses are around the corner, you know. It'll be easy if you beg your mommies and daddies. <laughs> now get out of my sight. I'm about to have some fun. What? To hell with that! Don't bother with him. Makoto's safety is more important right now. Three weeks for three million yen. These have taken a serious turn for the worse. You could barely afford to pay for Kawakami. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to drag you in like this. <laughs> For real. I was stupid. I must agree. You should have easily imagined this happening. Hey, Yusuke. Hey, he's just speaking the truth. I was so caught up in trying to be useful. All right, enough of the blame game. What's done is done. I'm gonna cause trouble for Sis, too. Sis? My older sister has a commendable job, and she's a much more remarkable person than me. 
A lot happened after we lost our father three years ago. So it's just us living together. But I'm still a child. So all I am is a burden to her. Hmm. And that's why you were so reckless? I just wanted to be useful in some way to someone. You know, I might not get your whole situation, but ain't it a bit off saying that you're useless to her? It's the truth, though. In particular, I have to apologize for what happened to you. Huh? Now that I think on it, the truth about Kamashita must have been covered up by the whole school. I had my suspicions, but I couldn't do anything about it. No, I didn't do anything. Had I cared enough, I could have done something. People like me must really be what others call scum of the earth. Real scum wouldn't call themselves that. Huh? I'm the same. It's just like you said before. I was closest to Shiho, but I didn't do anything. Besides, Kamoshida's the one to blame. Shiho understands that, and I do too. Takamaki-san. You didn't have a place to belong either. Isn't that right? Me either? We won't let anyone fall victim again. Now, what should we do from here? I'll do something about the money. So can we please just drop the case with Kanashiro? Um, no. No can do. We're all caught up in this. We can't have you rushing things on your own anymore and making the situation worse. If only we could do something about that bank. Ryuji! Bank? Oh, right! The bank! She isn't useless at all! She may be our key in! Hear me out, you guys. Our key in? What do you mean? A cat? Um, are you all okay? No, this is a flashback caused by drugs. We're not okay. I am especially not okay. We've become Kaneshiro's targets. That means we've become customers of Kaneshiro's bank. I see. The reason why we couldn't enter before was because we weren't considered his customers. And wouldn't you say that she, in particular, is a special customer? Let's take her with us. She is responsible for our current situation. This seems like a terrible plan, but okay, we're doing this. Whoa, I don't follow this at all. What else is new? She risked her life doing something so reckless. At the very least, she has the right to know. Won't you come with us? What? Wait, to where? Yeah, where are we going? Where do you think we're going? Beats me. People. Like, I, I, how are Yusuke and I the only ones on top of this? Seriously. A canine? It's Fox. Be quiet. The shadows are going to notice us. A monster cat? I'm not! That's Morgana, the cat that was in his bag. This is what happens when we come here. That voice? Takamaki-san? Where are we? We're inside Kaneshiro's... Uh, well, the world inside his heart. What? It's another reality in which Kaneshiro's distorted desires have materialized. Another reality? It's floating in the air! Th this is reality? My goodness. <sighs> I I'm sorry, it's just... But since this really exists... I can't doubt it. 
good. A reality that one's heart shows. Is it like the application of optical illusions in social cognitive psychology? Pardon? That's something we have no idea about. I see. So stealing one's heart, that may be like overriding their cognition. I think I kind of get the logic behind it. Ain't she more amazing than you? Dude, Ryuchi! We're about the same! Then, does that mean there's an ATM version of myself somewhere in this world, too? Perhaps. Regardless, we can change Kaneshiro's heart and make him confess if we steal his treasure. If it all goes well, that is. <laughs> we'll make it go well. Everyone will notice us for sure if we take someone like Kaneshiro down. Our justice will also become resolute. Think we'd be able to give courage to those in need if it happens? For the sake of those in need, huh? You sound like my father. Your father? No, that don't mind me. You want to go to that bank, right? Let's go then. If I've become a customer of that bank, then they'll have to let me in. For real? It came to us. It's just as I calculated. You know how you can use your card to get into banks during after hours? I thought that I'd be able to get in, since I have the same identity as such customers. I'm kind of Shiro's source of revenue, after all. Ah, oh, that makes sense. Wow, this place is huge. I rarely gotta go to the bank, so this is making me kind of nervous. I don't... What? do you think happens at an actual bank it's literally just either depositing or withdrawing money that's all it is or taking out a loan which again would involve you taking money whatever Reiji. being in a bank with costumes like these is so obvious we are totally robbers you got that right it seems there will be a lot of shadows from here on Huh? What's that about? Enemies attack us here. I see. I've trained in Aikido. Don't worry. I can defend myself. Your Aikido is not gonna do anything here. But Lord knows you can try. Self-defense won't do much good against shadows. But then again, it's better than nothing. We have to go in from the front, don't we? I'm an honorary customer. So I better act like one. I will be useful for you guys. Come on, let's well go. Well then, let's head inside. All right. Well. Shall we go? All right, we're going in. business do you have here? I had a feeling this would happen. Come at us. No, no, wait! She's one of Kaneshiro's customers. I'd like to speak with the bank president. Excuse me, but do you have an appointment? I need to talk to him. Now let me through. Kaneshiro. Yo, banks have presidents? Yes, but not the political sorts. In theory. Ha! Topical. Please, Please wait. wait. Perception is to the right, towards the back. I strongly advise you do not attempt to go elsewhere. Okay. 
We shall go this way then. Perception is just past the store. Perception is just to the right. Don't go anywhere else. This is the reception office. Hurry on inside. Ooh, a mountain of cash. I'm gonna take this. How many beef bowls could I eat with this? Really? Unauthorized entry, property damage, and other disturbances. That comes to three million yen in total. You're here regarding that, correct, Miss Beautiful President? It must be quite a tough gathering so much money. I'd be willing to give you a loan, you know. You gonna call it off, then? No. A loan. The interest rate is 10% a day. 10% interest a day? Um... Uh... That means... Uh, one day is... It's 300,000 yen. Oh, jeez, that's a lot of money. There's no need to be alarmed. I have a more manageable option for people like you. That was your plan from the beginning, wasn't it? Quite the impressive insight. Nijima-san. Or should I say, the younger sister of the beautiful prosecutor, Sai Nijima. How do you know that? Please don't underestimate our intelligence network. My, what wonderful goods have come falling into my lap. Don't be ridiculous! Young women are such great assets. They lack strength, be it social, physical, or mental. It's as if they only exist to be devoured by the strong. That just might be the rule since the dawn of history. You truly are despicable. You better be ready, Kanashiro! We're gonna snatch your treasure from you! Don't make me laugh, you petty thieves. My citadel has the highest security installed in it. Oh, jeez. Anyone will do anything for money. I'll rob you of your lives as easily as I breathe air. <laughs> Oh jeez. Uh oh. It's Mr. Kaneshiro's orders. Eliminate them at once. Okay. Uh, let's try Frey. Magar. Okay, good. He's frozen. He's gonna use rampage. Totally evaded. That's how. That's how we do. Time for some technical damage here. And then we'll use Morgana's baton pass and give him the old case for technical Garu. Beautiful. Um, let's go ahead and use Mafre. Magaru? Persona's got some options, but we better find a weakness. I am thou. Prepare yourself. Oof. Okay, I didn't quite work out. 
Sweet. And that should do it. The target is currently stuck here. We need more backup. Don't let them escape. We must take them down. Seriously, more backup? What the? There's no end to them. Have they really been hired with money? We're in trouble at this rate. Let's run. We're out. Why did the security guards turn into monsters? And what were those supernatural powers? We told you, your Aikido is useless. Now move. Could those have been the personas you mentioned? Does now really look like the time to be asking that? We need to retreat. Makoto, make sure you don't get separated from us. Hurry, Joker. The exit's just over there. You seem to be in quite a pickle. How dare you sneak around, Kaneshiro? Those would be my words. However, I do thank you for providing me with such wonderful goods. It's time you disappear. <gasps> Managing a bank is tough as it is. So, it's my policy to kill clients who are more trouble than they're worth. Having one impertinent brat disappear is enough to set an example in that other world. Please, stop! Oh, I wouldn't damage an asset like you. They're dead men walking, but you'll be just fine. Your sister is quite a beauty, though. I'll make sure to make her my personal slave. Once I get bored, I'll just sell her off. Oh, poor sis. She could have been successful. If only her younger sister wasn't so dumb. My sister has nothing to do with this! Then you better start taking customers tomorrow. All you gotta do is endure it, and do as you're told. Endure it. Do as I'm told. You'll learn three million yen in no time. Although your life and everything along with it will be a complete wreck by then. <laughs> I've been listening to you go on and on. Shut your damn mouth, you money-grubbing asshole! <gasps> Have you decided to tread the path of strength? Yes. Come to me! Very well. Let us proceed with our contract at once. I am thou. Thou art I. You have finally found your own justice. Please, never lose sight of it again. This memorable day marks your graduation from your false self. What the hell? A persona? No, dude. That's a bike. I can feel it. Myself. Me. Got it. Wow. Nice. What is that? I've never seen anything like it. You better earn your keep, or else I'll kill you. I will not lose heart again. Ever. I'll go full speed, non-stop. Right, Johanna?
Don't get all cocky just because I normally behave myself. I am done playing nice! Let's go, Johanna! Full throttle! The enemy's agitated. Take them down and make an opening! All right, so Makoto has become our brand new party member. Uh, she plays a little similarly to Morgana if you take a look at her skills. She has a lot of really cool stuff right off the bat. So first of all, I want to go ahead and use Mafray here. And second, before we uh, give the baton pass to someone else, I want to show that she has a nice physical ability called Vajra Blast. Uh, does medium physical damage to all foes. She can do? heal uh, people with uh, Diorama. So if you don't want to use Morgana as your active healer, you can. And she actually is pretty good at it. Uh, she has Raku Kaja, which increases defense for one ally for three turns. So she is a character that prioritizes increasing defense and healing. So if you like having, you know, offense and evasion, that's fine. But if you want to focus on more defense, Makoto is a good character to have in the party for you. And then she also has Makajama, which gives a high chance for get to one foe. This will make it so they can forget how to use certain attacks. Now then. Let's do the combo. Mafre! Go down! Some options, but we better find a weakness. Might as well just keep using my fray over and over. Uh-oh. Oh, and Morgana's out. And Panther's out. Okay, we seriously need to use some good stuff because this turned bad really fast. Joker cannot afford to go down. Just gonna use my fray and hope that this works out. There. Now, let's get out of here. Okay, that was a little closer than I'd have preferred, but hey. We still leveled up. Oh, good, Yusuke. I'm glad that uh, Mishima helped you get that new skill. We know how to get in now. Our objective's been accomplished. But how are we getting out? There's only one exit, right? So, you're totally the fist of the Phantom Star now, huh? Actually, shut up. Do you want to get smacked? I'm going on ahead, so follow me. Damn. Okay, we have a path. Get in! So you'll stand against me no matter what. Very well. I'll wait for you all. Okay, so I appreciate you doing that. Counterpoint, you could just raise the bank to where we can't reach you again. That would solve all your problems. There's no escape in reality, nor will you break through the security system here. It doesn't matter what you do. You can kiss your bright futures goodbye.
You look stupid in that shot. Man, talk about wild. That was no Aikido. That was some hardcore ass whooping. I am so not pissing her off. Feel like she'll rip off my arm. Yeah, she will. She does exude that aura. Oh, stop it. This is the most exhausted I have ever gotten these past few years. But it felt pretty great. I never thought I'd become part of the phantom thieves I was after. Sis might faint if she found out. You mentioned her earlier. She's a prosecutor for the district, and she's investigating the phantom thieves. Wait, ain't that bad? No need to worry. A normal investigation would never lead them to a world like that. Then again, it must have been fate for this to happen. What do you mean? I can't be like my sister. I had a feeling that there'd come a time when we wouldn't see eye to eye anymore. I'm thankful to have a sister who works so hard, but... There are times I feel sorry for her, too. And after hearing my persona's voice, I clearly understand how I feel now. It appears you're not as reserved as you make yourself seem. I was just doing whatever the adults told me to. Won't she be perfect as our advisor? She's fearless and has a sharp mind. Sounds good to me. We've needed someone like that for a while now. I'd be honored if I can help out. We had way too much testosterone anyway, so I feel much better. It's from Kaneshiro. He's reminding us of our debt. So the Kaneshiro over here doesn't know what happened inside the palace. That's right. But his palace will be affected if the real Kaneshiro's cognition changes. We can't be lax. Seems it'd be best to avoid unnecessary contact with him until then. Three weeks left, huh? There's that security system, too. But if we pull this off, it'll definitely be great! We'll crush him like a fly. I'll make him regret making me angry. God. She is scary. Like, I love it. I love it. She is absolutely terrifying. Anyways, let's begin our operation tomorrow. First, we need to secure a route to the treasure, like always. You guys are finally starting to get used to this. I'll be waiting for the call to meet up. Motorcycles are cool. I wish my persona was like that. Yours is on a ship, though. Dude, you kidding? Motorcycles are way cooler than dumb boats. It'll be just like the song. I'm a phantom on a steel horse, I ride. Don't say such things. And for the record, I am most certainly not wanted. Honestly, I'm mostly just surprised you know how to ride a motorcycle at all, Nijima Senpai. Do you got a license? A regular one, yes. Nice! Can't wait to get my hands on one, too. That aside, mind if I change the topic for a moment? What is the matter? I'm sorry, everyone. I know I'm not in any position to be saying that. I truly do. However, I must apologize. It was my actions that dragged all of you into this mess. On top of that, I misunderstood your true intentions in this. If only I could have realized what was happening to Suzui-san, too. Come on, we don't need to talk about that now. It seems there are still lingering issues on everyone's minds. Now's not the time to be talking about that shit, though. Don't we gotta be doing something about Kanashiro? He's right. Very well, I understand. Anyway, I will do my best to make sure I don't slow you all down. Well, we were at odds with each other until just a while ago. But Ryuji's totally right. We need to work together to overcome this. Nice. Makoto seems like she'll make a reliable advisor. But now we're going up against a real criminal. Stay on your toes, okay? Hey. Another box came for you. 
Sweet, we got the blur alarm clock and the face beautifier. It's my order from the home shopping program. All right, well, I think that's a good enough spot to stop. We've been at this for quite a while, so next time on Persona 5 Royal, we're gonna re-enter Kaneshiro's palace and do everything possible we can to change his heart as quickly as possible. See you guys then.